You were selected to be a part of the premier group of Mariachi Spectacular All-Stars because you are considered a torch carrier of the Mariachi Flame. What does that mean to you? It's a huge honor. Uh, I actually started coming to the conference in 2010, and I was just amazed on how the instructors, um, how the instructors taught the music that was given out, and just the the main concert at the casino was really a good experience. Tell us about your first experience with mariachi music. Was it part of your family? Something you discovered on your own? Did you learn in school? Can you share? My first experience, uh, seventh grade. Uh, I'm originally from Odessa, Texas. I started off in seventh grade and I played guitarron. And ever since then, I've stuck with it. Was it at this time that you became passionate about the music or did it come a little later on? I can say at the time when I started in seventh grade, it, it, I really fell in love with the music. I just wanted to learn uh, so much about it. Uh, I started listening to a lot of recordings, uh, started getting on YouTube, asking questions, and uh, of course coming to the conference as well. How important do you think music exposure is to young children and why? I believe it's important to young children because it gives them a different direction. If, if they're not comfortable with, uh, let's say, going as a math teacher or into science, being a doctor, and music's a different way for them to express themselves. Have you personally witnessed any positive changes in any students you've taught? Yes, I'm actually a music educator, and uh, I can say that my students that I've taught in the past have gone off to, and, how do you say it, uh, gone off to have good uh, careers in college. Who do you consider to have the most influence in your musical career? Now, is that the same person that continues to inspire you today? Oh, there's so many too. Actually, uh, a local from Albuquerque, uh, Raul Ojeda. He was my first, one of my first teachers in guitarron, and I truly, he truly inspires me every day. And if it wasn't for him, you know, I wouldn't be here today. A role model for younger generations. How do you hope to inspire this generation and the way musicians who are such a major part of the Mariachi Spectacular of Albuquerque may have inspired you? I hope to inspire them that they keep up uh, with the tradition of Mariachi music because uh, it's here to stay, it's not going to go anywhere. Can you tell us how did you select your instrument? <laughs> Funny story, I wanted to do football first. And at the time, my mom was real protective of, of me. And she says, if you're going to do football, you're going to do mariachi. And it's a funny story. I didn't know what mariachi was at the time. And as soon as uh, school started, uh, I got into both football and mariachi, but I stuck with mariachi. Where do you see yourself as it relates to mariachi in 20 years? Well, I'm actually uh, moving to Los Angeles to perform, or actually not perform, but play with different groups and hopefully get in a professional group one day. What piece of advice would you share with young people who want to start a career in mariachi? Practice, practice. Uh, practice an hour, two, eight hours. It, it's, it's the main thing. Practice, listen to recordings. How has mariachi impacted your life? Mariachi has impacted my life because I've met a lot of new friends, a lot of different musicos, uh, networking has been real big, and uh, I guess the friendship with different uh, musicians. My name is Nathan Garcia, and I'm the 2021 All-Star Guitarron Player for the Albuquerque Mariachi Spectacular.